Wilf Yates joined the Army to make a difference, but nothing prepared him for his place in history or in the heart of a nurse named Ann Davis. As a member of the Australian Imperial Forces, Wilf took part in the capture of Mont Saint Quentin in France, one of the greatest achievements in any army in World War I. In that fateful campaign, Australia suffered some 3,000 casualties over three days of fighting. But those lives were not lost in vain. The victory helped bring the war to an unexpected end. Wilf's heroic tour of duty was brought to a halt with a case of common trench foot. In the London hospital, Nurse Anne inspired his imagination. What would prompt a young girl to give up a life of relative safety to work amidst the horrors of war? She healed more than his body. She healed his heart. Their love story, inspired by the wartime diaries of the author's father, will transport readers to the terrifying and heady times of the Great War. After the war ended, Wilf returned to Australia to start a new life together in the lonely bush of Australia. There, he reclaimed his pre-war life as a timber cutter and bullock driver to support his new family. When World War II started, he answered the call to duty to serve as an army inspector in Newcastle. Danger is never far away in this lovely, thrilling story of mud, blood, and romance. The Red Rose of Romance and War by author John Yates. Visit authorjohnyates.com. Grab a copy now at Amazon.com.